The NES was cool, it was awesome, but the second you left your living room, well, it was useless. What Nintendo did to fix that was they gave us the Game Boy. It wasn't the world's first video game system that you could take with you. It was the first that was any good. This thing was like, oh my god, a portable game system that I can take with me everywhere. I became obsessed with Tetris on the Game Boy. I couldn't have a conversation with somebody without seeing the Tetris shapes behind them. I loved my Game Boy. And I would hook my Game Boy up to my friend's Game Boy and we would play head-to-head -head Tetris against each other until the batteries died. You can put different cartridges in it and play different games. And these are games that reflect games we play in the arcade, but there are also games that are specifically designed for the Game Boy. And it doesn't backlight, which means that when you're trying to play it in the car at night, mom's yelling at you to turn the light off because she can't see the cars behind her. It's amazing. Now you can sneak video games into your bed and play them under the covers. I think the 80s were the great decade of the socially alienating technology development. Things that brought you away from other human beings and into your own world. But, I mean, if you're a kid, it's pretty great. Jingle all the way back. If you're a kid, it's pretty great. To the best Christmases ever. The best toys. This I had to have. Had to have it. The best Santas. <laughs> and the best memories. 